It is a loud crowd in Boston. Thunderously loud. Encouraged that way by ex-Bruin Mark Savard. Cranking them up. Game number five, and it's the same goaltenders that we've seen through games one through four. The best of three series now. Let's see who steps up here in game five. It's Wagner, but it is Hainsey. Wagner slowed him down. Hainsey played it on. Tavares lofted it back out. And it is controlled back in by Zach Hyman. Twisted it along. Marner couldn't pull the trigger on his shot. You can see the just bounces going Toronto's way, but the skating is there, the pressure is there, and the thought to attack is there. Osternock and Hainsey here. It comes back on to Krejci. Got a little pass on for DeBrusque, who's able to charge by and around behind the net. Debrus to the outside, Kruger shot, and that deflected wide. Taken on now by Pasternak. Ben with a run in front and rattled around off of Anderson and can be tipped back out again, and it's Krug regathering. So it is thrown back over by Rask to Krug, but then a pass that Carlo wasn't looking for, apparently. Here is Tavares, rushing one in front. Oh, the shot blocked by Krug, and the rebound came near the front of the net, was grabbed off by Bergeron. A little bit of a cross check that was in the uh, area of Bergeron by Hyman, who now takes this, sees the puck come free, walks in, save made by Rask, and a cover, and a bit of chaos here. Foster knock again. Bouncer came along, and it's Johansson sending it further. With it is Krug, squirted one on to Bergeron, then on back to Marchand. Then it comes to Bergeron, and the shot would not go! Sent on to Bergeron, tried to pop one around in front. McAvoy takes a look, gives it to the back. Grizzly across, and then it is held. Krejci there in the final minute of the period, tried to dish it off the coil, poked across. Puck came right around in front. Goch, or I beg your pardon, Dermot up with that. Moving along his coil, penalty time is up. Three quarters of a minute to go. McAvoy sent one, and it was spiked one as it tried to connect with DeBrush. It's Muzzin to get it. Muzzin connects through Janssen, brushed ahead by Kapanen. Sized up there by Krug, dropped off for a hurried shot that is right on goal from Matthews. Grizzly able to dump it back in, around it whirls, and it is Muzzin dropping it on, but kept alive by Krejci. To the slot, a shot on, it's off, and a rebound! Two strong saves by Anderson that time, the second on Pasternak. Another shot, and he turned that one aside from Grizzly's stick. Now it's Grizzly yet again walking it on. Shoveled one that went off of Krejci and is cleared out of play. Is it a penalty? It is. They're going to force some mistakes, and that's going to cause some turnovers. And great chances right there for the Boston Bruins. And a near miss here. And then all of a sudden, there's panic. And Mitch Marner just chops at this thing completely out of control. Bruins have their third power play pass. Escapes back near Anderson. He's able to fling it along, but Krug tried to punch it, and here comes Kapanen on a breakaway. Moving on in. No! Rask got a piece of it, so did the glass. Played back off, and it's Posternock to take it. Posternock trying to work his way along, and he has trouble. It's turned back over to the Leafs again. Here's Zach Hyman stepping by. Hyman wedged off. Down to the ice he goes. Play continues. Working hard to get back on side Johansson, and now he's off the ice at the bench for a change. Dealt on by Chara, whipped further by Pasternak, brought in by Marshawn. Marshawn crosses over, kicked it off for Shetty! Oh, and it went off the post! Though the Bruins are celebrating, and there has been no signal of a goal! Well, we get a look at the overhead angle here. Krejci, high glove, that's right off the post and crossbar where it meets. A good call by the officials on the ice. Puck at the goal post, we have no goal. Yanked around behind and able to turn and take it now and work to the outside for the feed to DeBrusque was crazy and the save made by Anderson. Meanwhile, it is played ahead by Dermott. Up the wing now for Tyler Ennis. Here's Ennis with some speed around in front. Save made by Rath. Tyler Ennis with a dazzling move and it's cleared back down becomes an icing. This is a good save by Rask because you think about how long he's gone in between facing shots. Awfully difficult for a goaltender to stay sharp. Final minute of play, second period. And we are as we started. No score. Marlow on a cross. A shot and a save made by Rask on Kapanen. This time it was on goal. 
the Leafs are able to start ahead and go. Jake lopped it on. Here's Moore starting by. Moore a rising shot, and that one directed up off the high glass. Another shot, and that one kicked away. Outlet pass. Steaming on ahead with it. Now is Corrali, and that one is a beautiful block there by Travis Dermott, who was sliding across. And he's on the in, sticks on the inside, and it's a, just really all you can say. That's a terrific play by Dermott. Came over, sled into the pass or the shot, took away a lot of time and space, didn't give Corrali much of a chance. Tavares gave it back to Matthews, dropped it off for Marner again. 42 to go, thrown in front for Tavares, then given on back to Marner, led to the back to Riley, given across now to Matthews, back to Riley once more. Riley a shot directed wide, Tavares, bad angle shot, another try in front, trying for the backhand with Matthews, another try from Tavares, wouldn't go through. Held it there and closed off effectively enough by McAvoy, but the puck upper grabs in Kapanen, turning his Matthews, got it to Muzzin. Muzzin stepping in, gave it across, Matthews scores! Austin Matthews! It's one nothing Toronto. Boston is challenging goaltender interference. To do that, you have to have your timeout left. And if it's incorrect, you lose your timeout. If correct, the goal's disallowed and you retain the timeout. Now the question is to Karask outside of the blue paint. And if he is, Hyman's entitled to that ice as well. These may be the most important seconds of the series. Call the ice stands, we have a good goal. Wow. wow, I'm shocked at that. Just three shots on goal by the Bruins in the last 23 minutes of play. Set up there for a shot, oh, and it's set wide, and the stick breaks. Good defensive play there by Zaitsev, an unfortunate break for Johansson as he didn't wasn't able to get all of it. But it is Hainsey twisting a little pass to Matthews. The careful play is back ahead for Riley. Riley brought it on, got it on to Janssen. Janssen across for shot, score! Kapanen! And it's 2-0 Toronto. And Kapanen makes no mistake putting it home. Good job by Riley to drive hard through, through the middle of the ice. A well executed three on two here. No chance for Tuka Rask. And the Leafs are feeling it. Meanwhile, around behind it can be taken there by McAvoy. Tried to play it to Coyle. A chance in front, Johansson. Another try, Coyle, and that was stopped by Anderson. Krejci goes around behind, gets it on to Pasternak, whips it on back to Crew. Watched by Hyman, gives it on to Pasternak. Pasternak, side of the net, shot, score! And it's two to one. Situation room has initiated a, a, a challenge for half side of the blue line. I think that looks good to me. That's a tough read from that angle. There is no offside. We have a good goal. One last draw. Bergeron and Tavares. It's over for Marshawn and a save made by Anderson, and that's it. And the Leafs have taken game five and go back to Toronto for game six hoping that they can force a handshake line and an eventual date with the Columbus Blue Jackets.